Hi, my name is Mackenzie, and I'm the president of the Panalink Council. The Panalink Council oversees eight sororities that are included in the National Panalink Conference. I'm going to tell you a little bit about us today. So the history of NPC. The National Panalink Conference was established in 1902 and is one of the oldest and largest women's membership organizations. It was founded to promote values and ethics in women's sororities and to encourage their members to be active and responsible leaders in their prospective communities. It provides guidelines and resources for its 26 international women's sororities and serves as a national voice on contemporary issues of sorority life. A little bit about our values. As a panel at council, we are committed to relationships built on trust through transparency, accountability, and mutual respect. Innovation in our core values of friendship, leadership, service, knowledge, integrity, and community guide us in fulfilling our mission. The recruitment process. So the panel like fall formal recruitment process is called mutual selection. This means that potential new members start by meeting and learning about all the chapters, then select the ones they want to learn more about. Chapters complete a similar process. Each day, potential new members spend time visiting with fewer chapters until they are matched at the end. This process is highly structured and requires pre-registration and paying a registration fee. Spring recruitment. In the spring, chapters who are under panelonic total are eligible to participate in informal recruitment. Since not all chapters participate, the chapters plan these recruitment events themselves. And then a little bit about the new member process. So after receiving a bid, a new member goes through a variety of informative and fun gatherings till they are initiated at most six weeks later. New members have members trainings, learn the history and values of their organization, will get to experience sacred rituals, get to know each other from new member retreats, and my personal favorite, get matched up with an older member that can mentor you throughout college, we call Big Little Reveal. Member experience and requirements. So each week, every organization holds chapter meetings, or chapter for short, where all important information and upcoming events or, or opportunities will be discussed in these meetings. Throughout the year, organizations hold a variety of different workshops, such as risk management, mental health, study sessions with resources, and interview and resume workshops to help you grow professionally and mentally. Every chapter has a philanthropy they are partnered with and help raise money for their philanthropy each semester by hosting a variety of different events. Each member is also required to complete a certain amount of community service a semester. Some examples are volunteering to help run events at local elementary schools, river cleanups, canned food drives, and donating supplies to local police and fire departments. We love keep helping keep our community of San Marcos beautiful and a wonderful place to live. Lastly, a variety of fun social events are held each semester for each chapter's members. These include day parties, semi-formals, intramural games, sister events, and many more. Please follow us on all social media. Our Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook are our TX State S-C-A-T-E handheld. And our website and email are listed below too if you need to contact us for any reason. If I could leave you with one piece of advice, it would be to get involved and take advantage of any opportunity you can get. Be confident in yourself and your ability and use an organization to help you develop yourself into the best version of you. When I was a freshman, I would have never thought I would become panel president, but joining MPC and using the resource it has provided me has helped me excel in school and my career path. I hope y'all all enjoyed and I look forward to hearing from you.